What is stop motion animation? Stop motion animation is giving inanimate objects around you life. These objects can either already exist or could be created through clay or other means. Once you pick an object, the animation consists of the following process. Moving the object by about half an inch, removing your hand from the frame, and then taking a picture. Afterward, you move the same object again, take another picture, and so on and so forth. The fusion of these pictures in a sequence, whether it be 10 or over 15,000, gives the object life through what is called persistence of vision. As a person watches an animation, he or she sees one image after another, but their mind holds on to the previous image just enough time to fuse that image with that following image. In other words, your mind is linking all the images together and fulfilling the illusion of motion. To start getting used to stop motion animation, it is best to start small. Try picking a very simple object piece of paper, a pen, a box, or a paper clip. Choose something that is very easy to move and will likely stay in place if you leave it alone. Pick a plain surface, such as a desk or a floor that is well lit. Ceiling lights or desk lamps do a good job. Any digital camera will work fine with stop motion animation. Nowadays, most digital cameras take pictures of 5 megapixels or more, which is more than enough. A phone's integrated camera will also do the trick. Place your object on whichever surface you choose and start taking pictures with your camera. Note: Do not move the camera while animating yet. Keep it stationary. If the camera moves while you are animating, then the result will be a choppy animation. In other words, it will be hard to see. Make a simple animation of about 20 to 30 pictures to begin with. Make your object move across the floor or desk to get used to the process.